So this is not really a, an event for the Charles Foundation, but he asked me to mention it anyway. Uh, as you know, we're, we are looking for dolphins and he's always looking for other things, like gorillas and jaguars and panda bears and people, of course. <laughs> and uh, so he had uh, heard Richard not too long ago, months ago here at the house. Got so excited he wanted to see Richard again. And Richard has, of course, nothing else to do. <laughs> Uh, somebody in the boonies said, Florida, what else can you do, right? So he came down, so we have a little uh, concert uh, with a little show from Hitesh, hopefully some good food. And thanks to Barbara, my wife, uh, she made everything. Yeah. Uh, she wants to say a few words, she can do that too. Uh, no? Okay, so I would just say, uh, to get a little bit in the mood, we listened to a first song uh, from Richard. And then after we get all excited, then you can grab some of food, find a chair if you want, or stand, whatever your preference, or lounge on the sofa and just ignore everything that's going on. That's perfectly okay too. I think that would be the best part. And then, uh, well, here's some music, here's something from Hitesh, and then just a couple of But um, uh, I uh, want to just very briefly uh, uh, share with you an experience I've had. It's been an eight-year experience. This, pro this project started in 2003. And uh, it's been a, a real eye-opening experience uh, traveling through 46 countries. And I can't say that I alone worked on this book. This, the, in fact, the support systems that are required to do a book like this are just very, very important. And for example, Melanie, who's got the video there, she gave me some very good, important advice a couple of times about photography. And, uh, you know, all the, the clients, the, even the person giving me a massage uh, during my time was very important. And so you can see all the different people, the camera shop people, the researchers, illustrators. So it really requires uh, a large group of people to do uh, the book that you see here in my hand. Who gave you the best advice? Uh, it's difficult to tell. I think it's, uh, everybody has something important. That's how I look at it. Now, since the book came out in, uh, uh, the, uh, in uh, uh, September of last year, Costa Rica a couple of days ago, uh, and Aussie from Brisbane, who I had the pleasure to work with. Who I had the pleasure to work with on this project, which is the Crosswater Sea Ecology, that's the first thing. It's uh, um, probably the most published hospitality project in the world. And then you get into the main reception uh, area. So you can see that you arrive here, and you cross the bridge, and that's the river, and then that's the main place. It's the first bamboo bridge wow. to be built in the world outside of Colombia. Oh, we brought in one of the, the top most bamboo expert, uh, Simon Velez, uh, from Colombia. And you can see, there is, that's the arrival experience when you arrive at the Seco Lodge. Wow. It really is a wow kind of thing. And, and as you're walking, you get these real nice windows to the natural world mm -hmm. as you go through. This bamboo uh, that you see there is the one that's cut and made into this particular, uh, you know, the bridge. So it's all sustainable? Yes, it's, I would say, probably the most sustainable uh, building material that I know of. This is the Stylostachys rubescens, which grows uh, my height every seven to eight days. Oh. Wow. So you can imagine, you just cut it, and you build it and then it grows up again. It's just amazing. So you can see, you can have a nice little watermelon juice 
and enjoy the, the river from up there. Well, what I want, and so that's the when you come at night, that's wow. the experience. Wow. Manasseh's book, uh, uh, Siddhartha, there's a whole piece about rivers. And what's amazing is if you take one drop of water, that drop of water is on its way as it continues and it ends up in the ocean at some point. And, and, and how the Buddha, in a very spiritual way, connects it with what human lives are like as well. So the idea was to like become the river as you live your lives. And so, uh, we're going to do a duet, an audio-visual oh. duet that you just heard. <laughs> so this is the one where I'm going to ask each one of you to just transport yourself and become the river. So when you see whatever you see there, let the, let the slides totally go through you. And also uh, the music uh, we have selected is designed to like as if it's a river. That's the meditation that I do when I'm traveling.
Concerts, you can buy t-shirts and the t-shirts have the names of all the different places where they're going to be performing. Well, you have to come in front here, Barbara. So I came up with this t-shirt. It's 100% 100% organic t-shirt, which, which has the butterfly, which is the rating system. And, and it's, on the back side, the back side. It's, called, it's called the Save the Planet 1, 2. And it's all the different places where uh, the presentations are going to be taking place. Uh, they love the book launches. So there we are, Barbara. All right. So I guess on behalf of uh, I guess Stefan and Barbara and all that, uh, what I suggest is that if anybody wants to get a book, I'm, I will be very happy to do the autograph for you guys. Uh, otherwise. Uh, you know, people are free to go wherever they want. And yeah, it's a big day. We it's have a big day. Some people are working, so we don't want And to I know that uh, we'll give Mark and Richard some privacy now. Yeah. That they, can, <laughs> they can work on a couple more tunes uh, before Mark goes home. <laughs> just say that first measure a hundred times for Just them. get this. Just get this, Mark. Oh, yeah. sorry, one second. There you go. <laughs> <That's all. laughs> but Richard has also brought uh, uh, some of his CDs. So if anybody wants to get some, please talk to him. As well. Half price on any book tonight with the purchase of a gift.